something happening in my ear. Sometimes it might be a bit of a, a delay with the videos, but if you go to my website, they're available to stream as audios. Also, if you want to support me and support this free service, go to um, paypal.me forward slash Jason. Land. My brain went blank then. You know, I'm thinking I just want to do a relaxation session. Basic relaxation session. I'm just going to talk. sure you get yourself comfortable before you continue listening so that means you need to press the pause button and please do that make sure the uh, the play button is within reach though so if you're listening on your phone you know don't put it the other side of the room otherwise comfort although I'm now going to contradict myself in the same way as sleeping regardless of what sound is out there It was quite, it was painful anyway. 
with you I am pretty good at sleeping I suppose I should be in some ways I know on Twitter once I put a, posted a comment to someone uh, offering my sleep recordings as a you know as a suggestion for their insomnia and someone posted back you can't be much good if you're awake at this time of night. And it's like, what? I, I'm awake at night. I go to bed, not all night, but the earliest I would go to bed would be about two o'clock. Sometimes it's about four, three or four. It's not because I can't sleep, it's because I work well at that time of the night. It's quiet, less interruptions, and I just like that time of the night. So it's good and useful. say detrimental in some situations to be able to sleep regardless of how you physically feel there are a lot of people out there who have physical pain chronic pain and due to that have issues with sleeping It's not fair for them to have to go through that. It's not fair for anybody to be losing sleep because of a physical feeling, which is all it is. But luckily we can reduce that sensation. your mind and you stop caring about it which is a lot of what we do here a lot of these deep sleep whisper hypnosis sessions are about not caring about just 
just not caring anymore. It doesn't matter why you're asleep. As long as all the basics are taken care of. As long as the front door's locked, the cooker's turned off, you know, those basic stuff, then you're safe to just go to sleep. And we are wired, our brains are wired to wake up in an emergency anyway. So that's something else we don't need to worry about. Because worry and sleep really don't mix together. It's So they both cancel each other out. Worrying cancels out sleep. But at the same time, sleep cancels out worry. So maybe it can be a race to which one you choose to pay attention to. choice and when you reduce your worrying about a physical feeling that you have any physical discomfort dis that discomfort actually reduces that feeling originates from your mind from your brain and when you care less about it by the way I'm laying back in my big black squeaky chair that's why you That's one of the one of the really nice aspects of being a human because we do have choice. However, ironically, I talk about benefit of being a human I've never ever seen an animal that has any trouble sleeping <clears throat> even birds go to sleep seen a cat that's just wired like oh I can't sleep I can't sleep what am I going to do they can go from running and jumping and hunting and whatever else to being fast asleep without care in the world just the same as a dog 
the circles first, didn't he? Fall asleep. us to feel relaxed. So if every other species in the entire world pretty much falls asleep easily safety most of us hopefully have the correct conditions to be able to relax and this isn't about relaxing when you're on the bus or relaxing animals are born and they have to pretty much walk straight away we're born completely defenseless unable to do hardly anything yet we sleep like a baby
to sleep. supposed to be exciting
Let's see. 